Coming up, Super Tide Giraffe. And keep watching till the end of the show to find out how to get a free Zubatat coloring book. Zubatat, an island with every habitat. Zubatat, the animals are right at home with lots and lots of space to roam. Zubatat, an island with every habitat. The giraffe! Hi there, Zuby Ranger recruit! It's me, Jolly Jungle! And I'm here with. Me! Her twin brother, Jordy Jungle! Welcome to this episode of Zubatat Awesome Animals! Yeah! Yeah! Uh, Jordy! What are you doing? Oh! I'm being an awesome animal! Specifically, I'm trying to make myself as tall as a giraffe! Well, you know what might help you be more giraffe like? Mm, if I painted orange spots out of my body? If we took a trip over to the savanna habitat to see giraffes in the wild! Oh, that would be awesome! Which makes sense since they're awesome animals! Come on, everyone, let's go! Now this group of giraffes runs through the savanna. They sure look graceful. Did you know that a group of giraffes is known as a tower of giraffes? That's a funny name and super fitting because their long necks tower above most other creatures. Their necks are definitely long, some reaching as high as eight feet. Combine that with their legs and bodies, and you'll see that some giraffes can be as tall as 20 feet. Wow, I've got a long way to go before I reach those heights. Oh my, look at those birds. They're landing on that giraffe's neck and seem to be pecking at it. They sure are, Jordy. And believe it or not, that's a fairly normal occurrence. That bird is called an oxpecker, and in certain ways, it depends on the giraffe for survival. The oxpecker, which is also known as a tick bird, finds its food in the giraffe's fur. Given that it's known as a tick bird, can you guess what food it finds in the fur? Hmm, pizza? Mac and cheese? Ooh, ooh, ice cream? Close, tick birds eat, well, ticks. You see, the giraffe gives the birds its ticks to eat, and in return, the tick bird rids the giraffe of disease-carrying parasites. Not a bad trade. It's a win-win. I love seeing how well these two animals get along. Me too. It warms my heart. Oh, and speaking of hearts, did you know that giraffes have giant hearts? The average giraffe heart is about two feet long, and it can be as heavy as 25 pounds. That's about the size and weight of a large beagle dog. Whew, with all that heart, they must have a lot of love to give. And oh, these two are giving each other so much love, it looks like they're trying to hug. Actually, Jordy, while it may look like they're hugging, these two giraffes are battling with each other for dominance. As you can see, they're using what looks like horns on the top of their heads to poke each other. Ouch! On the plus side, those things on the top of their heads don't look too sharp. They're almost fluffy. You're right. They are somewhat fluffy. In fact, those cone-shaped bone structures are known as Aussie cones, and they're covered in skin and fur. Giraffes use them to protect themselves from predators. After all that battling, it's no wonder these giraffes have stopped off at a group of trees to eat some lunch. They're definitely getting their munch on. And they'll likely keep doing that for a while, because giraffes eat approximately 75 pounds of mostly leaves a day. That's around 250 bowls of salad. That is a lot of greenery. 
I sure hope they're adding salad dressing to that mix. <laughs> I don't think so, Jordy. In fact, giraffes rarely even add water. They only drink water once every several days. Luckily for them, the leaves they snack on have enough moisture to keep them well hydrated. Oh, and look! There's a baby giraffe! Baby giraffes are known as calves. Well, this calf seems a little bit shy, don't you think? I agree. It's staying close to its mom to keep safe. That's quite normal. Oh, did you know that giraffe calves start to stand and walk on the day they're born? Really? Amazing! Yup, no crawling for them. In fact, they even start to run within the first day or so of birth. I'm impressed. These creatures are just incredible. They're so graceful and beautiful. They really are, with their spotted fur and gentle nature. Well, I know it's time to go, but I'm sorry to say goodbye. Me too. And whoa! Looks like our giraffe buddy doesn't want us to leave either. That giraffe is running super fast. Yup. That's around 38 miles, or 60 kilometers per hour. As fast as a car. Just awesome. Well, I'm so glad we've learned all these Zuba facts today. I'm closer than ever to learning the ways of the giraffe. It's definitely been a wild ride. Bye for now, giraffe friends. And to you at home, we'll see you back on Zubatat very soon. Until then, Zubi Rangers, Rangers at the ready. Want to learn more about the animals on Zubatat? Join us at www.zubatat.com for more fun. Including the latest episodes, free coloring and activity books, and to earn your very own Junior Zuby Ranger badges. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and tell all your friends.